Dell PowerEdge 2900. Once the machine is powered off, power cables removed, we want to slide the server out of the rack and remove the top cover. The PERC 5 battery is at the top of the back on that riser in the first slot. The battery just unclips and you take your new battery and just take the new battery and plug it into the wire you just unplug and drop the battery back into the holder on the riser. Pull all your old hardware out of the server and then install your cover back on the server. So your server, once it starts booting up, you're going to get a warning saying that the battery's missing, defective, completely discharged. That's okay. It will charge itself. It should go ahead and boot past this part. If it does stop, it's going to ask you if you want to import the foreign config. And you want to choose yes. You do not want to choose NVRAM. Once you hit yes, it will pull the config off of your striped drives and it will write that um, drive information for the container onto your RAID controller. And what you really want to see is your system to go ahead and boot up into an operating system. Unfortunately this server for me runs VMware so I can't show you how to go into the Dell server administrator and see that the battery is actually charging. If you have any questions you should definitely call Dell or go to support.dell.com. Don't contact me because I'm not going to support your server. I hope this helps you and makes you feel more comfortable changing out your Perk 5i RAID controller battery. Um, good luck.